book one, chapter one of The Sun Also Rises opens with the narrator, Jake Barnes, describing his friend, Robert Cohn. Jake's tone is somewhat sarcastic and snarky, and he makes it clear that even though they are friends, he doesn't respect Cohn. Cohn is an accomplished boxer and writer who's been coupled with a string of women who are much stronger than Cohn himself, in Jake's opinion. Cohn is also Jewish, which deeply affects the way he views himself. It's obvious that Cohn likes and trusts Jake a lot and asks to holiday with him while he works on his second novel. The men disagree on where to go, although Cohn doesn't want to go anywhere that mm -hmm. might rouse his fiancée's jealousy. Jake's decision to start his story by describing Cohn gives the reader great insight into Jake himself. Jake avoids introspection and emotional appeals, preferring straightforward stoicism. As a member of what was dubbed the Lost Generation, Jake has become apathetic after World War I. He has little interest in the world apart from his own selfish pleasures. Jake and Cohn are both quite similar and very different. Both men love Brett. Readers will meet her very soon. Both enjoy sport, and both are insecure writers. Jake is an injured war veteran. Cohn remained a civilian, yet World War I extends its shadow over the novel's characters.